Okay, class, good morning. It's nice to see everybody smiling today. You're not gonna smile really in my class? Come on, come on, it's not that boring in here. We're gonna have some fun today in algebra. What was that? Yes, we're gonna be using these. That's why everybody has one on their desk. Okay, Tommy, don't even start messing with it because it's only for schoolwork, not for you to be drawing on. Close it, close it up, see? See, you're already dropping stuff. Guys, don't mess these up. These are for the whole school. So we, we have to return these. Do not mess them up. Yes, I know it's already a little bit messed up, but don't worry about it. But I want you to go ahead and write something on there that inspires you right now. And I'm going to write mine first. Great, my pencil is dried out. Guys, if your pencils are dried out... I have some more over there. Right, mine's dried out. But let's just pretend that mine says success, guys. My word of the day is success because you can't get anywhere in life unless you succeed your goals. Let me see everybody's board. Okay, Tommy. <laughs> you can't write bacon on your board. Okay, guys, it's not funny. Don't even give him any of the attention that he needs because he just wants the attention. Take this seriously. Do you want to be sent out of class? Well, don't, don't play around in here. Libby, what's yours? Inspiration, I like that. I like that. Michael? No, not gaming, not video games. I'm talking about things in life that mean the most to you and what you want to do in your life, you know, anything like your dreams, your goals, your future plans. Tommy, let me see yours again. Speedboat racing? Okay, you would. All right, that's enough. We're gonna use these for mathematics in a little bit, so go ahead and put them away. I just wanted to do that quick warm up. I wish my pen worked. Libby, will you go try to find me another marker because Mine is completely dried out. But anyways, guys, we have a month and a half left of school, and I want to get all this done so everybody can pass their grade. Because if you don't, if you don't pass this course, you're not going to be making it to the next grade. You know, so please just keep doing good. You got this, guys. What's that, Martha? Come here. You need to go to the school nurse. Ooh, yeah. I would get your mom to go get you a change of clothes. Yeah. Um, you know what? Grab my coat hanging up and wrap it around your... Yeah. I don't... No, it's okay. Don't worry about it. I got a washing machine. <laughs> don't worry. Just, you know, just take it home with you. Wash it. Bring it back to me. I trust you. Yeah, go ahead. Don't worry about Tommy. Don't worry about it. She's fine. Leave her alone. <sighs> Anyways, guys. I'm very pleased with how you did on your test last week. There was a couple of people that were a little behind, but you got caught up. Michael, did you turn in your quiz yesterday? I didn't receive it. Check your book bag. See, I told you it was in there. Thank you. I'll grade it later. Samantha, close that door for me. Yeah, thank you. Okay, guys, before we start our class, I want everybody to get out one notebook piece of paper. If you don't have a notebook paper, just come right here and grab one. We're going to do a quick little multiplication quiz, and whoever wins can, get, can go to the canteen in a little bit. I'm so annoyed with this. You couldn't find any markers over there? Alright, I'm going to have to go find one. Alright. While everybody's getting their paper, go ahead and start numbering your paper from 1 to 20. And write your name and date on it. I'm going to do the quiz along with you guys. And I'm going to do it as fast as I can as well. We're going to have 3 minutes to complete 20 questions of the multiplication. We're going to do the number 7s today. So, in three, y'all ready? 
Go ahead and finish writing your name on there, Michael. I'll, I'll wait a second. Go ahead. Okay, three, two, one, go. Time. Everybody done? All right, bring your papers up. Okay, while everybody's bringing their papers up, I just want to recognize the student of the week. Um, I'm very pleased with this student. This student brings their homework in every single day completed, and they are just doing a great job. I want to recognize Libby. Come up here, Libby. What's wrong with you? Your stomach hurts? Whoa, whoa, don't, don't, don't throw up. Don't throw up right there. Whoa, don't throw up. Oh, Libby. Go ahead and go to the school nurse. Go ahead. Well, well yep. You're you're still the star student. Go ahead. Oh, whoa. Whoa, don't throw. Oh. Oh. On oh, my purse. That's okay, Libby. That's okay. You're. It's okay. No, no, no. Go to the nurse. Go to the nurse. I'll give her a call and let her, let her know that you're here. Miss Smith. Libby is on the way up there. She's throwing up. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay, guys, already starting off on a rough day. Um, keep your mask up. Keep your mask up. Yeah, we don't need anybody else getting sick up in here. Michael, you sharpening your pencil? Okay. Um, you got to throw up too? Guys, what is going on here? The food at lunch wasn't good? It had mold in it? That is unacceptable. I will give the principal a call. No, no, no. Everybody's got to throw up. Guys, is this a prank? Is this a prank? I don't need no pranks in here today. I'm trying to get this done. We have a month and a half left of school. Oh, my goodness. Why are y'all throwing up? Okay. Uh, Let me let me go to the cafeteria to see what's going on. Um, Just stay put. I'm going to go get the school nurse, and I'm going to get a couple of the faculty and staff. Stay right there, guys. Guys, that was not a funny prank. That was not a funny prank. Libby was actually sick, but you guys, that was not funny. Whose idea was it? Let me guess. Tommy. Yep, you're getting rode up right now. That was not a funny prank. I'm very disappointed. I should give y'all all a bad grade for this. Okay, guys, that was not funny and unnecessary to put on TikTok. You don't put me on TikTok Unless you ask permission. I don't care. That was not a funny prank. And where did y'all even get that stuff that looks like throw up? Amazon? I wonder who bought it. Tommy. Ridiculous. You guys should know better. I'm a great teacher. But Tommy, yes, you were getting wrote up for that because that is unnecessary. Now the janitor has to come and clean all this right now and everybody has to leave my classroom. So that's 20 minutes of work that we could have been completed, but you guys wanted to prank me. It's not funny. Keep your mask up. Tommy, keep your mask up too. You got throw up in your mask? That's not my problem. You need to keep your mask up anyways. Yes, I did take the clock out of my room because everybody was trying to work really really fast in here because they see it's time to go and no i'm i'm not keeping the clock in here and do not have your phones out because if i see the phone out it's mine no i don't want to hear it no more tommy this is becoming a thing and it's not funny anymore we're trying to get through this semester guys it's important important in life to get this stuff done for your future so you can succeed and you guys aren't taking it seriously Yes, next week we are having a sub. Why? And you better be nice to the sub because the last sub had to go through physical therapy from what happened. I don't even want to talk about it. It's ridiculous. Yes. Yes, it is going to be her. So, yeah, y'all are going to behave for her, won't you? But if it's some random nice sweet lady you want to be a means, no, I'm not going to put up with that in my classroom. Tommy, put the turkey leg away. That's not funny. No, don't laugh at him. He just wants you to laugh at him. So don't laugh at him. All right, guys. I went through the papers of who 
did the multiplication and got them all correct. We had three people get them right. Michael, of course. Elizabeth and John. Oh, we had another one. And Marshall. Good job, guys. Good job. Y'all had them all correct, but don't give up, guys. You did do a good job. Yep. Yep. Just We're going to keep practicing tomorrow. We're going to do eights. Guys, I don't, you know, I want to be at home too, okay? It's not just you. I wish I could go home too. But it's important that we get the schoolwork done. Great. You just spilled a whole bottle of Coke on my floor. Go get some napkins. No, I'm not calling it a janitor. You're going to pick it up. Pick it up. Michelle, did you turn in your field trip money yet? This is all you have? Your short 25 bucks. You know what? Don't worry about it. I'll give your mother a call. I'll take care of it. No, it's it's okay. It's okay. Trust me, it's okay. I've been there. You can come with us. Yeah, you're going to be able to come with us. Mm -hmm. Don't worry about it, okay? Keep this between us. All right, guys. I've got everybody's field trip money. For Saturday, we will be staying overnight in the aquarium. So, everybody, please bring a sleeping bag. No graphic designs on the sleeping bag. Just a plain color. Yes, yeah, so you can bring your phones and chargers. Mm -hmm. We will be sleeping in the tank. Where we'll be able to see all the sharks and stuff. So, yes. Everybody's going to have their sleeping bag. Mm -hmm. That's right. Michael, get your head up. What's wrong? You haven't? You didn't get to sleep good last night? Okay, you can keep your head down for a couple minutes if you need to. Hey, Michelle, would you mind coming here right quick? Will you go into my purse and grab a few dollars and get me a Diet Coke, please? Yes, you know what? You can grab you one as two. Where is that dog coming from, Tommy? Did you bring a dog to class? You put it in the attic? Tommy, you cannot bring dogs to class. Thank you. Yeah, give me give me one Diet Coke, please. If they don't have Diet Coke, I'll take anything diet. Okay. Thank you. Tommy. Oh, my gosh. It's, the dog is peeing through the attic. Tommy, get that dog. Get the dog. Oh, my gosh. All right, guys, before class ends, I just want to say thank you for working so hard today. And I have a special surprise for everybody. Tomorrow, we're having a pizza party. Shut that door. Yeah, shut that door. But don't tell your other classmates. You will be in here for lunch tomorrow. Tommy, we're going to have a talk. Because you can't bring dogs to class. Thank you, girl. Diet, Dr. Pepper. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I'm glad. Anything diet. Yes, I'm on a diet. The ketone diet? No, I'm not on the keto diet. 
What's up, Michael? Move the decimal over three times. Start over. Just start over. You almost got it right, but you're missing a few things. Look, let me show you. You see where... Yep. Yeah, you got it. You got it. You got it. All right, guys. The bell rang. Hold on. The bell doesn't dismiss you. I dismiss you. Don't pack up yet. Make sure you finish that homework. It's got to be completed by tomorrow if y'all want pizza. Okay. Okay, you can pack up and go now. See y'all later. <sighs> what a day. What a day.